Hey, it's Advisor Matt with Lime Painting and I'm here with a client that just got limed. And her name is Caroline and look at this beautiful home and super excited about it. Caroline, how did you hear about Lime Painting? I saw some signs in the neighborhood and we walk our dog a lot and whenever I saw those, I would take a look at the job that you guys were doing and how neat the job site was and I was always impressed. Great, and you gave us a call and then you got three other estimates and what were you impressed most about Lime that won over your confidence to go with us? Mostly the thoroughness of the initial time when you came over and you talked about all the things that were going to be done and the quality of the Great. products you said you were going to use. Awesome, thank you. And then what did we do on your home? Um, basically everything. Painted the entire outside. It's just gorgeous, the colors you picked. What is that dark color again? That is called Deep Space. Deep Space. Everyone out there, do not steal this color. It's hers. <laughs> she copyrighted it. No, but the dark background on the body and then the white on the windows just came out beautiful. Um, did these as well. Did a lot of scraping on all of these ledges and just came out great. Let's come up here and talk a little bit about the dental trim. So you and your husband decided, you want to tell us what your vision was for this? Yeah, so my husband is a part-time woodworker, his second little job, and uh, I looked at lots of pictures and I tried to buy some, but I didn't find anything that was exactly what I wanted. So he built it and put it up and you guys caulked it and made it look very nice. Look at that, it's just gorgeous. So it came out fantastic. And I really like that it ties into the crown dental molding all around the home. So it's a lot of detail. And Jaime was your contractor. Can you describe the experience of working with Jaime? Yeah, he was awesome. He was uh, very neat, very thorough. And he seemed to care very much about the way the project came out. And one extra thing, I didn't even ask him to, but I noticed it later, was to see the detail on the chimney, which I thought was totally awesome. Oh, sweet. It looks great. Let's check out the back. Great to hear about Jaime's work. He is a favorite. And back here, look at this beautiful chimney. You want to explain what we did here? So as we were wandering around, you mentioned that you could clean up the stone, which they did. There was a lot of black discoloration on it and now it looks awesome and almost brand new. Look at that. Yeah, just really brought out all these colors again. It was faded and just dirty and now it looks really nice and clean. We did all one, two, three, four, five, six levels. <laughs> Came out good. So the back just looks lovely. And then were you happy with our process on your old railings they don't look so old anymore yeah they were totally peeled so it came out very nice wonderful in the garage i remember right there there was about 500 paint swatches <laughs> <laughs> so now they're all not they all match that window just looks so cool um yeah i'm just loving the white what was the white color again it was called Moonlight White. Moonlight White. Now here this side of the garage, you explain what we did here? So this was just a plain, unprimed, unpainted wood and it kind of stuck out in an ugly way. Yes. And it looks much better now that it's matched to the... Nice and hidden. And these soffits, I remember, had a lot of wear and they look really good now. Yeah, they were completely peeled. And here's the back of the garage. Came out nice, a lot of prep work. Look at that sheen. This was super faded, I think, and really chalky, wasn't it? Yes. Yeah. And that was all peeled, all the wood. Was all the wood. Looks great. And next is inside. So we did the bird room in here, all the walls, different color. Got the birds in here. Hello, birdies. Get limed. Okay, I said that. And then also when she painted, they didn't reach the top. It was just hard to cut in. So we just made a nice crisp line up there. And then we did all of the hallway area. All the way up there. All the way up this tall wall. It's great. 
All right, so thank you so much for letting us serve you. And would you feel comfortable using lime painting again in the future for any interior, exterior painting projects? Yes, I would definitely use you guys again. It was awesome all around. Great. Well, thank you so much again. And on the count of three, it's a tradition to say get limed. One, two, three. Get limed. Get limed. Woo!